the Zweihander. Few weapons in the game of Elden Ring inspire such fear and admiration. The legend never dies, and in practicing with the Zweihander on the new patch, I was led to wonder, what is the mystique of the Zweihander? What are the whispered legends of the base cannon around the Grace? Why does this weapon, arguably more than any other, hold the hearts and minds of the Souls PvP community so strongly? Come along and enjoy some duels as we delve deeper into Zweihander on patch 1.10 in the weapon that is more than a meme and may make you more than a man. Zweihander has been a staple colossal sword from the early days of Elden Ring, and although it regrettably fell in standing after the crouch poke nerf of last fall, on patch 1.10 it's back in a big way. The length, unique thrusting R2, and lightweight give the Zweihander some unique properties that propel it to superstardom in the PvP gaming world. Regardless of the Ash of War you choose, Giant Hunt is likely suboptimal but way too fun to pass up, the new hyper armor changes combined with the crouch poke and general flexibility of the moveset for a Colossal makes Zweihander an excellent go-to for both duels and invasions in the current patch. What it lacks in scaling compared to Gugs, it makes up for in the extra opportunities for counter hit damage in the beautiful, sleek, lightweight design. You can wear heavier armor and still unga bunga with the best of them. Keep in mind that while you are in hyper armor frames with colossal weapons on patch 1.10, you get a 17.5% damage reduction in PvP. This means that you win a massive amount of your trades and the mindless mentality of smashing R1 in your opponent's face far from being punished with this weapon, is often rewarded with ridiculous get out of jail free trades because of your impressive damage reduction. There are a few downsides to the weapon, long recovery times, it's very whiff punishable which is the correct way to fight the weapon, and although this goes without saying, the hyper armor doesn't trade with everything. But for a good time in Elden Ring on patch 1.10, I'd be hard pressed to suggest another weapon, not just for celebrating the patch, but for celebrating Souls gaming generally. The Elden Ring's wise descended from a long line of meme weapons to which there are many adherents. Giant dads who have fled to the shadows since the Dark Souls days now proudly wield this easy to obtain weapon with ferocity, inspiring awe and fear that I will get back up and pwn you. So when you pick up the Zwei, you aren't just picking up a sweet weapon, you're picking up a piece of art, a piece of gaming history. You've entered the cult of the Zwei. All praised as why. Power up the base cannon.